we can talk about that some. I'd be glad to do it. Hi, Congressman. My name is Kathy Warner. I'm from West Point. And just one point, I didn't read the bill like everybody else, but is uh, pre-existing conditions going to be considered? This is one of the things that I think you'd be happy about. Pre-existing conditions, as the draft of written, will not prevent you from getting insurance. And uh, I think this is a very important thing. I could every now and then run into somebody that uh, some of our young folks that uh, they got diabetes or they got something or whatever, and they're really doing well. I mean, they're smart and they're out there doing a good job, and they got oh, I got a chance if I could go across town or or to another state or something and have a nice increase. But I can't do that because I'm not sure I can keep my health care in jobs. And People don't change their jobs. So therefore, yeah. with that we. As I, we're working very hard, that will not be there. Yeah. And just one other thing I want to say, I work in health care, and we do pay for people that are illegal aliens. We pay for a lot of people that don't have insurance. Not everybody knows so that. So the emergency room. Right? Yes, we do. Oh, yeah. So well, it's, it's being done now. So it well, you're right. right. That's a good point. Yeah. Thank you for making that. Yeah. The, the cost of your premium now is up considerable because of that very reason. So it's not it's not a free thing. It's a very expensive thing. Will you give me my sponsor? She's responsible to keep you on schedule, so uh, without, uh, Sally, I'm going to take another question or two. And uh, you, 